The Cog Honda. Basic information. The Cog was an advert that was released by Honda on the 6th of April 2003 to display the new Honda Accord. It lasted for 120 seconds and uses a Rube Goldberg machine made entirely of parts of the car to display the product. Towards the end of the advert, we begin to hear the start of Rapper's Delight before we hear a voiceover saying, Isn't it nice when things just work? Form and style. This advert is a standalone and interestingly doesn't fit into any other form. Similarly, it doesn't have a specific style. It could be considered surreal or humorous, based on the hilarity of such a contraption existing, but the use of the advert not fitting into any norm makes it incredibly unique and memorable, even for those of whom the advert may not appeal to. Codes and conventions. The uses of shot and editing are all done to be suggestive of the product's quality. The shot is a continuous one with little to no edits, and the camera movement is smooth and slow, keeping focus on the course. This is all done to represent the ride of the car. Furthermore, the different parts of the contraption show off the features of the car. We are shown the tyre's grip, the alarm system, the windscreen wipers, specifically its sensitivity, the accessibility of the folding chairs, and a few of the other internal functions, like the induction fan. We are also given a subtle demonstration of how expert the craft of the car is, and we see how finely tuned each section of the course is and how gently each transition is. The subtle imagery is also presented through the minimalistic use of sound and lighting. The sounds are entirely comprised of metal on wood, metal on metal, mechanical devices, tyres, and electronics. Towards the end, however, the start of the song Rapper's Delight is played, which is used to add a little light-hearted humour to the advert and make you enjoy it a little bit more. Finally, the use of very simple light and background is effective in its way of keeping your focus on the car and its parts. Another thing to note is the absolute lack of special effects, once again used to keep focus on the car. Techniques As mentioned, there are multiple hidden messages in the advert. Each section of the course shows us various features to the car. Emotionally, the ad is supposed to make us feel impressed at Honda, and in particular their car. They also want to make you feel happy about owning the car. Characteristics of products or services The benefits and unique selling points of the product are based on its simplicity and how, despite this, it is a quality product. They show us that it isn't overcomplicated, isn't likely to break down, and has a lot of useful features. This would appeal to a buyer as it would give them one less thing to worry about in their life, and can trust Honda for the quality of their car. Audience classification. Due to this appeal toward a simple and reliable car, the most likely people to be attracted toward buying the product would be the ages of 25 to 50 and have a family, whilst needing a solution for their sometimes hectic lives. Generally, the advert would also fit into groups B and C1, also due to the appeal of a simple solution for their daily commute. Persuasion techniques. Finally, the advert uses the three main persuasion techniques, however the use is quite subtle. In the case of Logos, we aren't presented with facts or statistics, but rather we are shown the features and reliability of the car. Through Pathos, we are made to feel impressed at both the ingenuity of the car and Honda for their product and the course. There is a use of ethos through the voice at the end of the advert, which is spoken by a minor celebrity, Garrison Keylor. Isn't it nice when things just... Furthermore, there is use of the technique of plain folks. This is shown through the simplistic lighting and colours, paired with the similarly simplistic sound effects. <laughs>